follow me, gang gang. We're picking up right where we left off here in Baldur's Gate 3. So, let's go over what happened last episode. The girls and I went into Last Inn to see if there was anything else we needed to know before entering into the dark. And I'm glad I did that because in this big room that I missed, there's a man named Art Kolog. I think that's how you pronounce his name. He was found in the shadows and is in pretty rough shape. He keeps singing the same song over and over again. And a bard knows when they're dealing with another bard, so I tried to see if we could connect to him musically. Had no luck. So I pretended that in my spare time, I was a doctor and knew exactly what he was suffering from just by looking at him. And with Nurse Shadowheart, we were able to diagnose him with being physically fine, but psychologically detached. That is the best we came up with. We're not licensed. So Tav, Shadowheart, Lazel, and Karlak were off exploring the Shadow Curse lands and hoping that we'd find some interesting things. And we did! We stumbled across one battle where we were all completely fine and did extremely well. We found other things, but mainly we found a man out here and his name was He Who Was. Mm-hmm, that's his name. And he had a raven. That's what caught my attention was the white raven that just kept flying nonstop. It did not take a break. I was very impressed. He who was, was using Speak to Dead on a corpse of a woman named Madeline. He pretty much told us to fuck off. But the raven crowed and I guess helped him change his mind. I'm not 100% certain if that's what the ravens said or anything. My, my speak to animals was not on. Sorry. I can understand eagle and other birds, but not raven. He who was wants us to go find Madeline's ledger so that he can punish her spirit for the crime that she committed. What crime was that? I guess she murdered a bunch of people. Um, I feel like I'm not getting all the facts here. So I'm going to come back to this later. We got into another battle, and this one was a bit rough. Lazelle went down almost three different times. Shadowheart was doing fine at first, but then she got adhesive whipped, <laughs> got pummeled, and then went down very fast, just almost in two turns. Tav almost went down multiple times, but not only did he get adhesive whipped, he got thrown up on. I, th I think Tav had it the worst. Just, I would rather go down three different times knowing that your companions got you than to get thrown up on. Just, I'm just saying. <laughs> Karlak was fine. She was carrying all of us like she always does. This is why I bring her everywhere. This is why she does not leave my party. Because her health does not get past halfway. Like, it does not deteriorate as quickly as all of us here. She's carrying all of us. That's why, that's why I show her all the love and attention she needs. So that she can keep doing what she's doing. And also, because I just, I just love her. She's just too cute. I told Housen that Art Kulog... Again, I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right. I told him that Art C was at last in and he just kept mumbling and singing about Daniel. And Housen said for me to meet him there and he left my camp. I mean, if he was that bored, he could have just told me, you know, just I would have made it somewhat interesting for him. He just he was never never wanting to join my party. I didn't think he was like a full member yet and that makes me sad because I thought he could be a companion. But, well, maybe if we just help him out here, he will join us officially. I think that's what's going to happen here. I don't know. We'll find out today. That's pretty much it. You're all caught up now. I went back to my OG outfit and now I look flawless. <laughs> Are you feeling better? <laughs> Fan you and me. Uh, mm -hmm. At least he's not getting worse. Climb, climb, climbing up, up a tree. tree. It's true then. Oh, hey, Halsey. He's met Daniel. 
There's no other way he'd know that name. How do you know that? This is just what we needed. Well done. Thank you. We need to wake him. He must know something about where to find things. What do you think we've been trying to do, House? And you got any ideas of how to wake him? If he was able to escape the Shadowfell, then it mustn't have managed to consume his spirit. Well, not all of it anyway. We need to unlock whatever's left of him inside his head. There must be something to trigger him. A word, a memory, an item. We just need to find it. He used to play a loot, right? Maybe if I find that, I can help him. Yeah, let me see what I can do. I don't deserve you, my friend. Housen, I'm doing the bare minimum here. Don't, don't, don't be like that. I've always wanted to do this. Let me, let me just have my moment here real quick. It's like my own little personal spotlight. Okay, that's enough. Oh, Shadowheart, you missed it. Y'all, look how much I've covered. Our asses. That's not even close. Like, there's still so much more of the Shadow Curse lands. I feel like I barely scratched the surface, and yeah, I feel like I've also done way too much. <laughs> Just, how the fuck am I supposed to cover everything in the Shadow Curse lands? Like, it's impossible. <laughs> I'm gonna miss something. I already know. Look at that. I, I found where the Tieflings were ambushed by the Absolute. This is just depressing. You know, us Tieflings, we, we, we get treated the worst, I feel like. Like, everywhere I look, there is a dead Tiefling. Always. I don't know what that says about me as a Tiefling. Like, are we supposed- We're not weak! I mean, look at Carlax. She's not weak at all. Just- why? Why are there so many dead tieflings everywhere we go? It's just depressing. Oh, and um, they said that there were kids that were killed here? Where are the kids? Hmm? I just see adult tieflings everywhere. You mean to tell me that they picked up the dead kid bodies? Like, why? Why? Why would you tell me that there are dead kid tieflings here? And I don't see them. That sounds terrible to say. I'm just now realizing that. But... I mean, if you're gonna just give me that info and try to traumatize me that way, at least let me see it. If you really want to get my sympathy, let me see it. You know what? No, scratch that. Just don't tell me kids were involved, okay? Don't tell me kids died, but yet when we get to the crime scene, we only see dead adult tiefling bodies. You mean to tell me, what did they do with the kid bodies? That's a little, that's a little creepy and disgusting, now that you think about it. Just don't tell me that the kids were involved. That's all I'm saying. Hells, the curse has torn open the ground itself. I mean, don't get me wrong. This curse is, is terrible, but it's just visually stunning. Night Orchid? Wait. Wait, that's... That's what Shadowheart likes. Shadowheart, I found your flowers. Here, here, I found them. May the yeah, darkness yeah, and all that. You. Look, remember when you told me Night Orchids were your favorite flower? Rings a bell. Why? Because I found you one. Oh, hells. You didn't pick that by hand, did you? Um, They're deadly poisonous. What? Joking. <laughs> They're safe. And beautiful. I hate you. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't have anything to give you in return, I'm oh. afraid. Oh, no. You're, you're fine. I told you I'd find you one, and I did. So I just wanted to keep my promise. I don't expect anything. Well, perhaps I can come up with something later. All the same. That's sweet, Shadowheart, but again, I don't- I'm not expecting anything in return. It's just a friendly gesture. In fact, I give y'all things all the time. I'm not expecting anything in return. Not gonna lie, I'm a- I'm a little lost right now. I do not know where I'm at. Um... I'm trying to- I'm trying to find things to do here, and I'm just kind of just walking around in the dark. Just- I don't know where I'm going. Um... Let's try to go over to the shadow battlefield. Yeah, I haven't been over there. Let me, um... Yeah, let me just fast travel there. I think it might be easier. <laughs> okay, we're, we're here. Let's go over here. We have not been here yet. Oh. Just auto-saved on me. Cool. Okay. Um... Ooh. There's something over here. She was no fun. All I wanted was to play! Um, did this kid kill the Skit Yankee right here? Blazel, I think I think he might be in trouble here. I know I I know what to say, but I'm I'm wanting to save here too. Um, 
I'm kind of cautious about this kid over here. There's a lot of dead bodies around Someone's here. Someone's coming. I'm sorry? Someone new. Maybe they want to play. Oh, hell no. Where's the kid? I swear I heard a kid around here. <laughs> Shit. I scared you. I saw it. Nobody beats me at hide and seek. Okay, you got me there. Will you play with me? No! You just gave me a fucking heart attack! I don't want to play with you. You know what? I could play you a little song. Would you like that, little boy? Not that kind of playing, silly. <laughs> Good answer. I want to play a game. It'll be really fun. Let me show you. <sighs> God. Do you have anyone else to play with? In fact, where are your parents? I have a mummy, a daddy, and a doggy. They'll be back in a while, but you're here now, and I want to play. They just left you behind by yourself? That's a little suspicious. Have you seen another little boy? His name is Daniel. I don't know anyone called that. Don't ask me again. All right, keep your secrets. Now play with me. Fine. All right, I'll hide, and you seek. Okay. Find me, and you win. Seems simple enough. And if I don't find you, what happens? Then you lose. My life? It's, what do I lose? You know what? Fine. Get ready. And no cheating. Oh, okay. I'm gonna count this under here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, ready or not, here I come. <laughs> I know exactly where he's at. He's not the best hider here. <laughs> Boo! I found you. You weren't supposed to find me. You weren't supposed to win. Don't be a sore loser, kid. I'm gonna save this just in case that this is about to get interesting here. I have a feeling this is about to be a bit more than hide and seek here. All right, we're good. Let's play again. Good idea. You're smarter than some playmates I've had. They always tried to leave before I was done with them. Oh. Try to find me again, but my family will be looking for you at the same time, so don't get caught. What? What? What did you say? What? This is this is not how we play hide and seek. Kid, if you wanted to be the seeker, you could have just said that. You know, you could let me hide or let me and my friends hide. Why do I have to do both? Why do I have to find you while hiding? This is not how we play hide and seek. Oh my god. Okay. Um <laughs> I'm saving this. I'm saving this. I have a feeling I'm going to ruin this somehow. So, the goal is to not get caught while catching the kid. Without getting caught. Okay. Alright, I guess the safe space in the house. So, let's just, let's just go in here. Tip-toe, tip-toe, be very sneaky. Tip-toe, tip -toe. So, okay. Taff, you're good. You're good right there. We have to survive this. Shadowheart, this is just hide and seek. We're we're not we're not gonna die, I don't think. Are we gonna die if we get caught? You know what? Let's You know what? We should probably do pass without a trace, right? Oh. We are not hiding anymore. I hope I hope that doesn't affect it. Oh, we cannot crouch again. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay, well. Um. How about. How about you go over here, Shadowheart? Um. Just in case of the kids over there. I don't know where this kid's at now. Alright, Lazel. You ready to play hide and seek too? Ooh, you know what we can do? She can misty step. She can easily misty step. You know what? This is this is not that bad of a hiding spot right here. Just up here on the roof. Who's gonna look up here? Who is gonna look up here? Blazel, that is that is a prime hiding spot right there. I do say so myself. You were good up there. Carlack, like this one might be interesting for you. Um. All I'm going to say is that I feel your pain. I am almost six foot. Like, I'm just probably like a, a fourth of an inch away from six foot. It was never, never easy for me to play hide and seek. Let's just say I was always the first one found because there weren't really any hiding spots for me. So, Carlac, -like, I, I feel like out of all of us here, you might get spotted first. I'm just saying I can relate. Oh, God. 
I'm worried about Shadowheart here, though. Oh! <laughs> did they did they see her? Oh, the kid's right here. What? He's right there. Hello. Hi. Pickpocket. Are we pickpocketing a kid right now? I, I can see you. I can see you. Why? You're here. Why can I not be like, hey, I found you, by the way. That was not out of all of us. Carlac found him. <laughs> Let's play my next move. Don't okay. I, I, I guess we need, we need him to actually get to a location here. Step. Let me just move over here. I mean, the kid is right there. Whatever it takes. Oh God, Shadowheart, please just crouch back down. We can get you back to hiding. See me. <laughs> Let's um. Okay. How are we gonna do this here? Need to tread softly. Softly. We do it very softly. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um. Fuck. Okay. We may need to get you invisibility. Just just to be safe. Just to be safe, Shadowheart. Okay, yeah. You should be fine now. You should be fine. Lazelle, you're good up there. <laughs> no one's gonna look for you up there. Alright, um... So far, so good. Yep, Lazelle, you just stay right there. Carla, you're gonna be a little bit more difficult. Um, you know what? The way I would hide is that I would just move wherever the seeker was not. That's how I would get away with things. But yet again, I would always get, get, get caught first. So, we just need to get you away from the people. Just just stay over there. Stay over there. You'll be fine. I just want a little look. He is right there. Can't afford to stay idle. Shadowheart, thank God we had invisibility potion just in Tab's pocket. Because you would have gotten caught right there. Okay. Okay. Um. This is the most intense game of hide and seek I've ever played in my life. What the fuck? Okay. Shadowheart, I know you're invisible and you're technically cheating right now, but I don't know how long this invisibility potion is gonna last. So just in case, just just stay away. Can they see you, Lazo? I'm a bit worried. I'm a I'm a bit worried because now you're stuck up there. Oh god, I think I just screwed over Lazelle. And she's very competitive. She's gonna get so mad at me if I get her caught. Um, Carla, you have to stay right there. The kid is right there. What do you mean? What do you mean? I found him. Okay, um, yeah, we'll just stay here for now. I'm sorry. <laughs> that wasn't fair. You know what? If it makes you feel any better, I think we got caught at the same time. Like, she caught Tav too. Mummy caught both me and Lazel. I don't know how she saw both of us, but she did. Um, okay. This is, this is gonna be a little bit harder than I thought. Hi, Future Swami here. And I'm here to tell you that it's actually not as hard as I thought. Snake, In fact, snake. I spent the next 30 fucking minutes trying to beat this game right here. I kept getting caught and I was getting upset because I knew exactly where the kid was. In fact, I was touching him. Just nonstop like, hey, I found you. Did that register? No. It just set, kept saying I was pickpocketing him. I was like, that's that's not what I'm intending to do. I found him. No, um, it's actually something simpler than that. But did I know that at the time? No. In fact, I took it so serious that I Sounds literally boring. benched Carlac. Oh, I brought in a no. Starion because I, I thought, you know, know, he's the sneakier option. We can't have a seven-foot tiefling play hide-and-seek. I'm a horrible person, I know. But what I found out eventually is that you need to stay in turn base until you reach... Or should I say, the kid reaches his final place where he's not moving, get out of hiding, and click on him. That, that's it. That's, that's, that's it. You're good at this. I'm not. Are you sure you didn't cheat? I did. But I can't let you think me a bad sport. Here's your prize. Oh, thank you. You'll need it. Thanks. Yay. 
Astarian, how are you doing? Hello, my dear. Hello. You know what? I think you're hungry. You can feed on me tonight if you'd like. I was so hoping you'd say that. Mm -hmm. Until later then. What? Why are we still rolling for stealth over here? Are they still out and about? Not back to glow, are you? Nobody likes a bad winner. I still think you might have tricked me. I did. If you did, I'll figure it out. You don't. You don't need to. I. I looked on YouTube to help, and it was something as simple as just me. Okay, so we're just still hiding over here. Why are we still creeping around? Y'all remember that big ass spider that I was creeping around like when we first got here yeah his dead body is in here i want to speak to it the corpse seems willing to speak but not to its killer oh oh yeah by the way i changed my eye color they're now red just i changed them when i benched carlac and brought a star in i just you know i was feeling some type of way a star in, can you please talk to this dead spider for me you can use the little voice changer if you want the corpse regards you lifelessly. Well, hello. Who are you? Raised. Forgotten. We are. Tried. I really don't care. What happened to you? If you don't mind me asking. Wolf. Cursed out. The corpse remains silent. It does not know. Of course it doesn't know. It's above his pay grade. But if you can tell me this, what were you doing? Shepherding the faithful, carrying a lady's light. It is what he said he could do. Traitor! Heretic! The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. He really doesn't like you, Tev. Well, I don't like him either. He almost killed me. Oh, before I end the video, I, I found this over here off of a dead Gith Yankee. I just want to do my Lazel voice here real quick. Okay. <clears throat> a map has been etched onto his intricate disc. Why, why would these difficult words, why would they just speak normal Githyanki tongue? I need to focus. The Risen Road winds through a mountain pass. Within the hills is nestled a sizable temple. Within the temple, the Githyanki people have established a stronghold. Pictographs reveal their mission to retrieve the Fuck, what is that word? Polyohendric relic. On behalf of the Githyanki Queen. Skakith! We've already done this. Why do I need to be reminded that my queen is full of shit? Fallen members of the Emerald Enclave. Casualties in the war against Kethric Thorn years past. The skeleton was more useful than the Githyanki writing we just we just read. Let me just equip the magical lamp here. Mm-hmm. Now we are ready to go through this. Stay close to me, y'all. If y'all don't want to be swallowed up by the curse, just just stay near me. We will we'll do this tomorrow.